to my channel guys what's up today i'm very excited about this video because i feel like this is going to be a double up video when i say double up i mean like i'm going to be giving you guys two looks with one wig i mean yeah you can achieve multiple looks with each and every wig that i've ever presented to you guys but what's so special about this today is that it's is some blonde hair and i'm going to be coloring i'm going to be wearing this hair in its initial state finessing it in its initial state and then we're gonna transform it into a whole different color so this is about to be a nice little compact video okay now this hair is this hair package i have today is from lumiere hair and it says nice hair from here human hair factory it has their email address and everything so this is actually the second package i'm getting like in a drawstring bag first and they put the box in there so I just go ahead and take it out and that's how it looks on the front i don't know i'm so spring about this i don't know why but i am so this is it says 100 percent human hair lace wigs oops <laughs> These are some of the stuff that are in there. This is just an in information card, you know, um, that I see first. Extra elastic band if you need it. And oh, I got some darker, uh, I got darker wig, wig cap today. Very excited about this. I have mostly the light one. Um, and then we have our hair. So this is the Body Wave um 613 blonde full lace wig and it's transparent lace yes it has some information on the bag as well it says 24 inches because i want to show you guys its truest state that it comes in you know as well and i know that i mean hopefully when all of this blows over you know the virus and everything after we come out of quarantine and stuff i know a lot of females will want to be all uh, you know out again and just be popping and i know blonde is a thing for a lot of females when they're ready to turn up so i mean this is a nice blonde wig it, it is body wave that i say it looks pretty straight to me though so as i said i'm not going to go in i'm not going to tone it or anything i'm just going to you know rock it as is go ahead and apply it as is and yeah who knows this video probably going to take me like a total of three days to complete i actually got my mannequin head wash i mean she still have some a lot of a lot of marks on her but she's clean she's <laughs> she's clean so all right so i went ahead and i applied this so i'm gonna actually style it before doing applying it as you guys know so i'm just gonna put some really nice soft waves in there with my wand and i just want to lay the roots you know down really flat Rods. 
You saw when I was cutting the layers in the front, right? This is what it helps it to do. It just looks like so vintage Hollywood-esque right now. Plus bombshell vibes. Like this is, I'm happy. I'm happy I made the decision to show you guys this wig in its initial state. I feel like I'm gonna give it like a more of a, like a blunt cut. When I color it, <laughs> like, oh my gosh. Guys, if you're looking for a bomb blonde wig, this is it. I'm very pleased with this outcome. If you want to see the little mini tutorial that I compiled on um, this look, it is on my Instagram in terms of the makeup. The makeup is simply, it's, it's, it's neutral vibes, natural makeup with wing liner and very bold lashes. As you guys can see, I am loving this. Oh my god, so just want to stuck up on the looks and on the ideas from now. You see, I'm giving you all the inspiration because when I time for go outside again, it's about to be lit. Okay, that's all I'm gonna say. That's all I'm gonna say because, honey, we've been inside like for just a couple weeks now and it feels like forever, but so grateful to be in good health and have life nonetheless like just make the best of it as i said pile up on all your inspiration and everything that you need so when it's time to go outside again you will be slayed so as i said before i want to give this a nice blonde cut and i just really want to transform it you know one wig two looks two drastically different looks okay so yeah I'm not gonna even take the curls out, honestly. I'm just gonna go ahead and cut it still with it. I feel like I'm probably going to give it a cut to about here. Here. Update you guys on was the lace. The lace is amazing, and that's the reason why I already I told you guys that I can't necessarily say HD lace is my favorite yet because I'm still testing out. I'm still testing them out. I just got into HD and transparent lace, and um, even though I've done quite a bit of wigs with both of those type of laces since recent times, but I'm still, I'm still, um, you know evaluating everything um so yeah but i'm not gonna lie that lace was really nicely melted all right so look at this i got all these bottles here i am confused right now as to which color i really want to transform this into uh i want it to be uh, like a colorful ombre vibe so okay so i i just want to mix up some stuff i'm not gonna mix all of these in one but I want to give it a very nice graduation in terms of color. I want depth. I want highlights. I want I want I want low lights and I want highlights and I want just a lot of pizzazz. I have like neon pink, aqua, jade. Oh sorry. Jade. More neon pink. Uh um, we got blue black. We got periwinkle, more periwinkle. We have violet gem, we have more periwinkle. All right, so those are the colors I want to focus on for the um, color transformation for this wig. Um, let's see how it turns out. I have my mixing bowl here. Can't do without the mixing bowl. I'm gonna start off with the mixing the darkest colors first. And I'm gonna let all of this goodness soak for at least 24 hours. That's just me. I want to be secure. I want to ensure that it's really, really drenched and soaked properly. So the darkest colors I have here are Violet Gem, Blue Black. Yeah, and I got some Aqua. So, let's see how this turns out. I'm kind of nervous. It's 
I just mixed up violet, gel blue, black, and the Avatar Aqua. As you guys can see, <laughs> this is actually like a navy blue. This gave me, and I had a feeling it would more give me a blue vibe. And I don't mind it now that I'm seeing this. I feel like I'm leaning more towards an ocean kind of vibe. So I want to do like a mixture of like, like different shades of blue. So I want to do like ombre. So I'm going to do it deep here in the back. As you can see, I left. I'm leaving out some, well, you're going to see in a few. I'm leaving out a bit of the tail end of the others to apply like a lighter blue down there slash pink. Or no, like a lighter color down there. Um, yeah. Uh, that's what I'm leaning to. This is really a freestyle, guys. It's really, really a freestyle. I didn't plan on this, and it's it's this is like art. I ain't gonna lie, this is like art. So yeah, I'm just kind of just winging it, you know, pretty much. Um, you saw the colors that I had. Um, so yeah. Here, I just poured jade aqua and a tad bit of periwinkle so to lighten this up I'm gonna use some conditioner with applying the blue to the top portion I'm going to put some more dark blue around here so now it's time to do the reverse coloring so I'm gonna put dark blue at the ends at the front and light blue at the ends at the back <laughs> so pretty excited about that Definitely giving me ocean vibes with the low lights and the highlights and I'm just going to leave this for 24 hours to really just marinate <laughs> that's what I'm gonna do so just stick around I'm so 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 happy I actually went ahead and blow dry this off camera so it's looking pretty good I'm going to go ahead and just start flat ironing it I want to wear it straight now because remember I already wore it body wave like for wavy when it was blonde 
Yes, 24 hours passed. Going into coloring this hair, I had no idea what I really was going to come out with, but I knew I wanted it to be a, like an ombre vibe. And when I was done, all I could think about is this one wig that I saw Argan did one Nicki Minaj, but it was with purple and like lavender, and also a wig that Spice wears. <laughs> like, it definitely looks like that's the kind of vibe I get from this. But I had no idea I was going to do this look. Or this color combo going into it like, you guys remember me telling you that yo I was just going to wing it and then in the back here it graduates into lighter blue again like it's just gorgeous like I've never really done a color combo like this before and this is like so much fun it feels so much like just art to me and I enjoyed creating this look I'm not gonna lie though this took a lot of time and stuff but nonetheless this is what i came up with i hope you guys enjoyed this video i mean it's kind of different it's a little bit more work than usual but i really love the outcome the fact that i could bring you guys like two different like complete looks with one wig i'm just happy <laughs> that i could do that let me know what you th guys think about this down below in the comment section let me know what other com color combo you want to see also let me know what other hairstyles you'd want to see it doesn't necessarily have to be with colored hair um yeah stuff like that if there's any special uh anything special that you want to see me do with a wig or just a hairstyle in general let me know all the specifications and the um, information on this will, will be down below in the description box Lumiere here big up on yourself because this wig is lit thank you guys so much again and i'll see you in my next video so until then go and big up on yourself